Pope St. Evaristus was the Bishop of Rome from the year 99 until his death in 108. He is venerated as a saint in the Eastern Orthodox Church, the Catholic Church, and Oriental Orthodoxy. His feast day is celebrated every October 26. According to the Liber Pontificalis, he was a Greek by birth, the son of a Jew named Judah from the city of Bethlehem. Some accounts suggest that Evaristus was a Hellenized Jew, which refers to those who were both Jewish and Christian, lived in Jerusalem and spoke either Greek or Aramaic. When Pope St. Clement I was martyred, the bishops quickly picked Evaristus to succeed him as they believed he could bring the church together, prevent the martyrdom of other Christians under Emperor Trajan, and stop the church from going into turmoil. As the Bishop of Rome, he divided among the priests the titles of the city of Rome. By constitution, he established seven deacons who were to assist the bishop and serve as authentic witnesses for him. In the three ordinations he conducted, he promoted six priests, two deacons, and five bishops, each one destined for various churches. According to the book, The Externals of the Catholic Church, Evaristus decreed that, in accordance with apostolic tradition, marriage should be celebrated publicly and with the blessing of the priest. While the exact date of his death was unknown, the text of the Liber Pontificalis suggests that Evaristus was buried near the body of Blessed Peter in the Vatican on the sixth day of the calends of November, which is equivalent to October 25, 108 of the current calendar. It is also said that the episcopal throne remained vacant for 19 days. The book further describes him as the one crowned with martyrdom. However, the Roman martyrology listed him without the martyr title. He is often represented with a sword because he was decapitated, or with a crib because it is believed that he was born in Bethlehem, from which his father emigrated. For more information about every saints and their feast day, please like and subscribe to our channel, House of Prayers for Everyone.